Hey guys, it is me, the Senile Simmer. We are here doing a new challenge by our good friend, Lori. She came up with the idea to create Sims based on the 50 states of the United States and giving them names that correspond to cities in that state. So we're going to go ahead and do some of those today. All right, our next pair will hail from the state of... New Hampshire, my hometown. I've been thinking about this for a while and I'm like, I don't know what I'm going to find for people names in New Hampshire. There aren't any, but we'll find out. All right, cities in New Hampshire. Yeah, they're, they're terrible. There's a Salem, but we just did a Salem, so we're not going to do that. I've been thinking about this for the last couple of days, actually, and realizing in my mind that there are no people names. Main cities in New Hampshire. Those are not people names. Nashua and Derry. Those, I mean, okay, I'm going with Rochester because, I mean, I, I've, I've heard of butlers named Rochester, right? And I live in Rochester, so um, that's definite. And we could go with Derry for a female. Derry's kind of like Terry, right? I think that's the best we're going to come up with. Rochester is the fifth largest city in New Hampshire. I mean, all of our cities are pretty small. But it doesn't feel like it. Rochester's one of those that has so much um, land mass to it that the people aren't piled on top of each other. So it doesn't feel like it. So it's kind of weird. Like, I think as far as space goes, they, it could, I think it's the second largest city. So it just feels like we have room to breathe. But anyway, that's my story about Rochester. All right, this is Rochester and Derry. All right, let's start with Rochester. See what we're working with here. Nope, nope. He looks like he could live in Rochester. And then for that one, we might actually start with her and just change her hair. Rochester. Good athletic slob. Yep, we got some of those here in Rochester. Okay, that's perfect. His aspiration will be... Friend of the animals. Alright, let's give him some nakedness. Alright, let's give him some hair if we could. He's athletic. We're going to give him a little more muscle, a little more body fat. He's in New England. He's going to be cold this winter. Um, cold weather. We need to dress him up really, really, really warm. Because it's cold as a witch's you-know-what up here.
What is the relationship between Rochester and Derry? That's his wife. I don't like this outfit at all. I hate it, in fact. Yeah, I like that better than what I had on him. He does have the friend of the animal aspiration. Maybe we should give him one of these wolf shirts. All right, does he wear glasses? I think he was wearing glasses on a couple of them, and I think that he might need them. I'm pretty sure we don't need any other jewelry or face makeup. Guys around here don't wear makeup. Alright, so here is Rochester in his everyday formal athletic sleepwear party swimwear hot weather cold weather all right, moving on to Miss Derry. Let's see what her traits will be. Proper goofball bookworm. Let's find her an aspiration. Painter extraordinaire. Let's get her some eyebrows. Let's give this poor girl some hair, shall we? That hair kind of looks good with her face. I'm going to go with that. I don't do a lot of blondes, so... Give her some clothes. All right, hand jewelry.
Does she wear glasses? We've got him in glasses, so I'm going to say no to her. Um, I think she wants a nose ring. And now we get to do makeup. Snow pants for party. Those are snow pants. It's a party at the ski lodge. We have mountains. We ski. I don't ski, but people ski. I didn't know there was snow pants. All right, here is Derry in her everyday. Formal. Athletic. Comfy sleepwear, party, swimwear, hot weather, cold weather, and that is New Hampshire done. Let's pop them into the gallery. There we go. The so next week we'll be able to do a 1% with Ohio, Illinois, Oregon, and New Hampshire. And I will see you guys next time. Have a great evening and thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you all so much. And I'll see you next time. Bye! That's going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. There are two new videos down below that you can watch. Leave a comment if you'd like. I usually do reply. Hit the like button to share it on your Twitter. I can be found on Twitter and also on Twitch. And above all, have a really great day. Bye-bye.